so that way they can oh, keep Whipple. Oh, oh, no way. Whipple always delivers something a little bit different. Generally speaking, here, it's Team Liquid who want to survive those early lanes and then get into the team fight phase where they have all these late game options with the kind of Zeri as well as the Silas. And a very early first Oh, ulti. Just go for it here. Oh, barely up. gets the knock up there. Now Bjergsen in a bit of trouble. Going to get stunned into the wall. Put in the polymorph. And FBI is just going to block with his face. That is first blood for 100. That comes to bite them later. And the TL side have to think they're happy to stop the potential snowball. The 100 Thieves could have started with the Dragons, oh, honestly. Yeah. With how this early game has gone for 100 Thieves. This is playing through bot. They almost defaulted to so many scaling picks throughout summer. Team Liquid is testing if he can still play Callista. So far, he's proven his way. How have been coming, Code J, the one in trouble. Vials, he's out there. Charm Lance from Ava. And that's an easy pick up there for 100 Thieves. Is there an extension? Whippo, now the next target. FBI is here. Open up the top lane. See you later. Whippo, that's three kills. For well, someday maybe checking for the flank. If not, just wanting to go for it himself, is going to be warded out now. But the teams are a little hesitant to pull the trigger on starting the Dragon. Team Liquid, though, trying to make them commit. I mean, Team Liquid doesn't have hard engage. So if they start the Dragon, they have no trigger pull for 100 Thieves moves in. So 100 Thieves is just eye caught contacting them in the river. And if TL goes in, then someday's going to be on a flank. A lot of spears in that Dragon, too. Yeah. Thanks for the leash. FBI looking to get it. No, it's they Santorin. It. Somehow Time gets it. Big Renata ulti as well. Santorin low, but 100 Thieves haven't found a chase just yet. It's Huhi zipping out of the Callista ulti, but not enough to lock down the Silas. It's a heist. <laughs> Team Liquid steal the dragon right from under 100 Thieves. That is massive for them scaling in this game. They do not even suffer a casualty, but 100 Thieves still want to apply this pressure. Gonna be able to get the mid turret on the tail end of that dragon play, but at the end of the day, for Team Liquid, yeah. 100 Thieves still has and still has tempo. And it's still gonna grow. This is the second Rift Herald. They've gotten the bonus gold from both of the first two Heralds that they've taken. They've gotten all the standing gold from the three outer turrets. And if they can continue this pressure and get to the inner turrets, those are the really juicy ones. And that's where they'll blow this game completely open. This time, Team Liquid do bring enough people for the defense, but is it enough to stop the Herald charging? It is not. Is it enough Ooh. to stop the next, though? Santorin popping the watch a bit early. Got caught by a stray charm out of Ari. Here's Whippo on the flank, bottom side of your screen. 100 Thieves will happily look for the Ergot as well. There is no towel, but the damage is done. Gold not popped out of it yet, but 100 Thieves are going to go again. Yeah, and there's no pressure anywhere else on the map, so 100 Thieves can actually just set up a, a tent right outside this <laughs> turret and just take the turret. Here we go, closer in there. Ulti's one, it's Bjergsen now going to steal the ulti as the rest of them go through. Zeri ulti pops as 100 Thieves. Maybe think better of a Whippo flipping FBI back in, but now Whippo caught in the front side, charmed off and taken down by the Callista as Team Luke would have to turn tail to the base. Yeah, Santorin caught out though. Bjergsen oh, again. Someday. Santorin here, someday maybe the one caught out on the other side, the stolen by ulti looking good, but it's not Ooh. enough. Straight charm again hits go. Oh. FBI's on a rampage of Renata ult. There he is. We put on the bottom side of the screen. Abadaga just melee range charm. Keep it nice and simple. The whole squad's here. Close is not even going to need to burn the ulti. It's Abba that picks up another. I am very curious what Team Liquid's conversation will be if they end up losing this game, which is looking highly likely now with an 8,000 gold deficit because they didn't have any prio in the early game. They're arguably better in team fights, but how did they get there? Because they have no hard engage and no prio. So how do they actually put themselves in a winning position? And 100 Thieves has done a masterful job of both trying to pick up right now. And there's a possible steal for Santorin if he gets the right eject with his ultimate. He gets the objective bounty, might still have time to TP. 100 Thieves clearly wants to bait for a fight, oh, but... run in them. And then you're a little bit tankier when you're actually in the scrap. So I really like this adaptation by Closer for this game. That's what you're talking about again. They got the Spears in, and now Someday's actually going to be the target. Whippo trying to find a hard engage angle, but FBI is going to turn off the brand with the rest of the team. Closer a little bit low. Now Whippo's the target. Not that tanky. In we go. The bailout will not be enough as Huhi. Going to get credit for the kill. 100 Thieves going to keep on rolling. FBI 1v4 just in the face of the enemies, but they'll take the one kill. That's all they'll need. They take the one kill. I'm curious if they go right back on the Baron because they want to be able to blow this game open. If it was just a one kill to get them off Baron, that would be a win for Team Liquid, but they now have to go again. Setup is here. Santorin again has the angle. No blast plan. Control it in the back. Someday dealing with it. Core JJ getting some damage down, but again, the spears in the back of the Baron make this steal so impossible. And it is closer. That secures that Santorin trapped in the pit will not be bailed out as 100 Thieves. But you know, just too difficult to actually do there. Nice. Fight by 100 Thieves, huge gold lead now. Team Liquid just confined to their base, doing their best to defend these inhibitor turrets, but without an easy engage option, like you're saying, it's hard to just try and pin up the, you know, Aatrox in the top lane or hop directly on top of the, the 
Kalista just standing in the mid lane, so they're gonna finally try and go on okay. Abadage, but oh, they might have got him. Jerkson found one, but needs more, and there's just too many yeah. dashes. That was the best they can do. <laughs> Half health him. There we go. Yeah. And again, FTX held advantage overwhelmingly in the favor of 100 Thieves. They're gonna take one in here. They've got one open in the bottom side. They're looking to open up the top half as well. TP back in from Arba just to make sure he can spend the last bit of that gold he's picked up. And Team Liquid gonna be forced back towards the fountain in short order. We're gonna get Poppy Copter Ooh. kicks out too. But Tower still falls down. Santoran can't play goalie for long enough. Yeah, closer with a flank after breaking the mid lane turret can kind of wrap around and make it difficult to step up and do wave clear duties. Abadaga lands a nice chunk. They're able to grab their second inhibitor turret and Hunter Thieves closing this one out clinically, moving their way down yeah. to the bot side to take out the third inhibitor. And man, Hunter Thieves has actually played this game so well, holding the prio in all three waves, getting the early dragons, using the rift heralds properly, and now systematically taking down three inhibitors and less. FBI very, very angry goes berserk on his teammates. Closer in trouble, but not dead just yet. And FBI should be able to take over the game. Set Torn and the rest of the squad are getting shredded. FBI open up for the triple kill. Is it may be a pencer on top of it all, Abadage flashing in, gonna take away kill number four, but more importantly, 100 Thieves back to business, a vintage bot lane performance from them. Woo! They will take game number one. 100 Thieves shut out Team Liquid in game one, not a single kill given over. Take the 